Wine and art. Could you make a living off combining the two? We'll introduce you to a man who's living his dream job doing just that. An American realist, Thomas Arvid started painting wine almost by accident as part of a series he was doing of pieces in red. And then when I did the first red wine painting, it sold right off my easel. So I had to do another red wine painting to go with my series, and that sold. And so I started cluing in. By the time it was the third and fourth wine painting, I was kind of focusing on, maybe I'm onto something. His paintings now sell for hundreds of thousands of dollars in galleries all over the country, allowing amazing opportunities to travel. And those galleries are located in tourist destinations like Laguna Beach, California, Hawaii, Napa Valley, Key West, Florida, St. Augustine, New York. Life at home is equally sweet. This is my commute. A home studio lets him stay close to his wife and two boys. And the success of his art has allowed him to enjoy the finer things. I built a wine cellar that can basically hold about 5,000 bottles of wine. Even the work itself sounds like what most would call a holiday. If I set it up and I get to do the photo shoot and then I actually get to drink the wine and then maybe start the painting the next day. And once he starts? As I'm working on a piece, if I get a little fatigued from working on it, I might pick up my ukulele and just play a little bit. And through it all, family has been the key. I've integrated my family and my work together where a lot of times, I just don't even feel like I'm working. And that's what I call a dream job. 